All right, so I figured out the Kelly pot. I use chopsticks to put coals on the bottom. And then the coals cook the soup or whatever we're cooking at top. We got a, basically an egg drop soup here going on. We'll put a little pepper in it shortly. But the, the coals, I just keep putting more coals in the bowl. And I keep the fire over here separate. Because I want to control the temperature for my soup. I don't want it to cook too fast or too slow. Actually, I'm going to put a little cornmeal in it to uh, make it a little thicker like a porridge. But I dropped, uh, basically it's onions and, uh, and bacon boiling in there with uh, two eggs dropped in. And it's going to be like a porridge. But um, when I was trying to cook it in the, in the fire over here, it got too hot. It got out of control. But here in this system, here at the Kelly Pot, I got much more control. I also have some hot water for some tea. But now I got a little bit more control. I can sprinkle some... Uh, uh, I'm, I'm actually going to make the batter for the... Um, for the uh, cornbread and I'll just put it in here because I don't have a pan to cook on uh, but we'll try with uh, another pan that's here anyway I know I'm rambling now but I'm just excited I'm just so excited that dropping coals in the bottom of the Kelly pot basin worked so well to maintain and control the temperature so that I wasn't having a raging boil a raging boil is okay with the with the uh, the, 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 the bucket pots or something but um, for my cleaning water, but I don't need it to be raging for my soup.